Hola chicos, ¿cómo están? Aquí con el último y quinto episodio de Minecraft Story Mod. Esta vez por fin llegamos a la parte final de esta increíble historia. Y también nuevamente agradecerles a los que comentaron ya esta vez más o menos en YouTube, pero igual comentaron más en WhatsApp, pero también muchas gracias. E incluso me dijeron varios que en el último episodio pues tenía que dejar a Romeo. Bueno, en la velocidad pues, ya que aparece después de enfrentarlo, tenemos la decisión de dejarlo o, o traerlo con nosotros. Y muchos pues dijeron, déjalo, acabo de ir a malo. Y todo eso pues, pero... Creo que ya veré después de jugarlo y veré si tomar la decisión correcta de traerlo conmigo o no. De todas maneras, continuamos con esa saga y llegamos al final de todo eso para ver qué sucede. Espero y que puse. De igual manera y muchas gracias a sus comentarios y opciones. Pues, pues encima y más allá. Se llama el quinto episodio. <coughs> Perdón si hace rato se escuchó como un gallo en mi voz. Es que estaba Previously tomando algo de agua. Minecraft Story Mode. Anteriormente me que Story Mode. Ya salimos de la cárcel, ya exploramos el mundo de Fred y ya enfrentamos a un coloso gigante. Ay, el vencedor tomó nuestra identidad y ahora está haciendo pasar por nosotros. Lo cual es injusto y no sé cómo los ciudadanos pueden creer que yo soy él. Las amistades de tipo... Ultimately, all losers who refuse to appreciate the gifts they've been given. Now, I won't stand for ingratitude, so I took my gifts away. Oh, but then, then, just when I thought I'd found a promising new friend, that is when I had a brilliant idea. The perfect way to weed out the bad friends from the good. To be appreciated. I became Jesse. I was right, of course. The plan worked immediately. Jesse's good friends flocked to me. Of the better, Jesse. Ay, sí. Hoy te pones mostrando a Luna y te da para hacer una noche fría. Underground forever. One more ungrateful loser buried alive. Y desde ahí encontramos a Ivo. Todo un ninja. <risa> Se ve que vio mucho Naruto. The saddest part of all, really, is that Jesse will never get to see how much better I've made Beacon Town. Quiero dar a pensar que se pasó por todo para poder alejarnos al enorme Enderman, el cual me gustaría no volver a ver. Realmente daba miedo. Y por fin volvimos a Ciudad Faro por un portal que Sara nos construyó y también creo que se quedó con radar. Sinceramente espero ver y bueno, nada más lo mejor es en esta última parte. Remodelar el lugar se nota mucho. Man, lucky thing that the admin didn't think to fortify these tunnels into town. Speaking of fighting admins. I can't help but wish we still had Zara around. I know she was, well, she was a little much, but having an ex-admin on our side seems like it could have come in handy. I guess she still scared me, though. I think Zara's already done plenty in the fight against Romeo, and she's been at it a lot longer than we have. She deserves a break. Yeah, that's fair. Uh, maybe Zara's lucky being where she is right now. She's not currently marching towards a fight with the admin. I'm just glad that friends of Fred stayed at the entrance to that that heckmouth. This is far too dangerous for them. Yeah. yeah. Jesse, when Romeo finds out what we're trying to do, we've seen what he does. I don't want to end up like Fred. I don't want Beacon Town to be like Zara's town. We've seen so many terrible things that Romeo's done. I just can't even handle thinking about that happening to the others, to our home. Hey, no one is going to end up like Fred. But how do you know? Fred didn't know just how bad Romeo was, so he underestimated him. We can learn from the people who came before us. I know it seems hopeless, but we can't give up now. There are people up there counting on us, and we are not going to let them down. Hear me? 
Yeah, I hear you. Let's do it. Woo! My, that was loud. Sí, de hecho. Oh, Luna. Here we go. Ah, ahí está bien. Vaya, tomamos la ruta que llevaba a la mina hacia Ciudad Farm. No. La sala de trofeos lo remodeló mucho. Destruyó casi todo y lo convirtió todavía en la, eh, lava. Joder, está loco. No manches, mataron a. No digo, van a matar a sus cerdos. You guys want to bet that's where the primary terminal is? The giant floating tower with no clear entrance? Yeah, probably. Hmm. We've got to find a way up there. Might be a good idea to hit the map shop. Regroup, get some supplies. Yeah, yeah, that sounds good. Ah! It's guys. So and he's with Axel and Olivia. We gotta hide. Oh, typical. Heading exactly where we wanted to go. Then I guess we just can't get caught. Why exactly are we having a whole festival devoted solely to you? Do we really have to go up on stage with you in front of everyone? Enough! Uh, you two are gonna need to do uh, a lot less talking and a lot more agreeing if you want to be a part of Beacon Town. Not so sure I do, actually. In fact, we were just about to head home. I'd be very careful if I were you guys, or there might not be a home to go back to. At all! It's just so easy for something bad to happen to a town. Like Champion City, for example. And boom! Uy, eso sí dolió. Me fue completamente destruido, por Dios. My no. Aguántese. Ay, hasta Luna siente lástima ahora. I had hoped there was still a chance of redeeming Romeo. No, I'm not so sure. Champion City. He blew it up. Just to make a point. I know this looks really bad, but there's gotta still be some hope that we can get through to him somehow. Now, how about you run along and get that fireworks show ready for the big keynote, eh? Okay, okay. Yes, admin. Uh, Jesse. I think the admin's distracted. Yeah, we should grab Axel and Olivia while we have the chance. What? You were always so worried about Champion City, and now? One less thing to worry about. Hey, Olivia. Olivia, Axel. Oh my gosh! I knew it. I just knew it. <gasps> Whoa! Am I seeing double? Shh. Jesse, I. What is? Come on, I'll explain everything. But we have to get off the streets. To the map shop, quick. Beneath the bedrock? Yeah, I still.
Esto sería un mundo para. construido debajo de la roca madre que supuestamente es that the Jesse out there isn't the real you, but arriba de nuestro mundo. Digo, nuestro mundo arriba de, de, del mundo de Shara. What no if me, everyone no in Beacon Town turns on you? I mean, with what just happened outside, Axel and I almost did. And we're your oldest friends. I mean, if we couldn't tell, I... Ay, por favor. Look, the admin is good, but he's not good enough to have everyone fooled, right? It's a pretty good Jesse impression. I mean, a totally evil version. Ay, por favor, but... yo soy bueno y yeah. es que... Por... I... You said there's a way to stop this guy, right? Petra! Stella sucks even when she's on our side, but nobody deserves that. Ever. Her whole city. Gone. In an instant. It's insane. Nobody should have that much power. Oh, it's our fault. No, Jesse, don't do that. We're why the admin is here in the first place. Everything that happens now is on us. So glad you guys are okay. Did Jesse tell you about the potato yet? The what? In the underneath, the we got our hands on something called a word of passage. But Hashtag but potato451. I know it sounds weird, but it's supposed to take away the admin's powers for good. Oh, I can't wait to see his face when that happens. Look at the state of my poor shop. I'm almost glad Nermi doesn't have to see the old girl looking like this. Is it even safe to hide out in here? <laughs> yeah, it used to be the safest place around. That was before the admin's goons were everywhere. Nothing to worry about. We've got our best fighter here with us. As much as I appreciate the <coughs> completely accurate <laughs> compliment, this is the admin we're talking about. Getting into that tower won't be easy. Hopefully, there's still something useful in here. Everyone, take a look around. Shout if you find anything. While you guys do that, I'm gonna keep watch. Doing okay, Luna? Yeah, I know it's scary. We're gonna get through it, though. Poor llama. Is this? Hey, Jack. By the tides, I'd almost forgotten about that stash. Are these elytra wings? Those are super rare. Sí, yeah. yeah, got them one time when I made a trip to the, the end. end. Nothing better for gliding. What was that? Sight again, Derm. Never again. <laughs> but sí, how did you get out of that prison? Entendí, because I broke them out. Ah. Ah. Ivor. Ivor, what on earth were you just doing, hanging out up there? Jesse, I'm a ninja. Okay, Where else would I be? Ninja. That is a nice outfit, Ivor. I know. Thank you. Oh, oh my, oh my gosh. Do you know who that is? That is Ivor. Founding freaking member of the Order of the Freaking Stone. That is a legend standing in front of us, Nurm, within arm's reach. And my shop is a complete wreck. Trust me, Jack. Best thing around Ivor, just be yourself. Uh, yeah, that uh, that makes a whole lot of sense. Thanks, Jesse. Well, here goes. Sí, sabe, Ivor, Ivor of the Order Winter, of the ¿verdad? Stone. Whew. This is quite the pleasure. Well, yes! Of course it is! Oh, me? Oh, I'm, uh, being a... I'm, uh... <laughs> Nobody. Uh, how are you? <laughs> He's Jack. Oh, well, hello! 
Always nice to meet a fan. <clears throat> yeah. Anyway, I am happy to report that your plan for the admin worked perfectly. He fell for my deception hook, line, and sinker. Story about you rotting away in prison forever? Big success. And after the admin's appetite for Jesse's destruction was satisfied, I returned to the prison by cover of night to free your friend from that cursed place. Between both of our enormous intellects, we figured out a simple way to disarm maximum security and escape without being blown to smithereens. It was incredibly when difficult. Happened. And took many, many days of intense mental activity. And a very large hole in the side of the Sunshine Institute, which I'm sure no one sí, will know. <laughs> there may be nice. I can't believe that you risked your life for us. You could have died. What if Ivor hadn't gone back? <laughs> Nurm, you are a treasure. Now that the team is back together, Ivor, we need to stop the admin. We're supposed to use our... word of passage at the primary terminal. Jesse thinks it's up in the tower. Yes, I believe that's exactly where it is. I've heard him reference such a thing several times. No one thinks to check for eavesdropping ninjas. I have learned a lot of information that way. Let me guess. There's guards, right? Yes, yes. Though I requested a post there, the admin appointed special golems to patrol the place. Just, uh... You sure we can't, like, reason with this admin guy? You know, I'm talking out. You? Wanting to talk it out? Jesse taught me to keep the explosions in Boomtown. That's actually not a bad idea. I could try. Right? I mean, if you could get me to talk about my feelings, it might be worth a shot. I'm formulating a plan. We just need a distraction. Maybe a distraction like Jesse's big speech at the start of JesseCon? Je that Con? sounds great, but elytra wings don't exactly go up. <laughs> they do with fireworks. Buena idea. Nerm, think you could get me a map of Beacon Town? Hmm. Oh, Here's the plan. Like Jack said, we need fireworks. Which the admin has stockpiled backstage at the event! Wait, isn't Stella in charge of fireworks for this thing? Perfect. We never get backstage without fireworks skilled uniforms. So we find Stella, and she shows us where they are. I'll grab them. We suit up, and boom! Backstage passes. Once we're there, we swipe some fireworks. Wait, what am I doing? You're gonna be getting me a bucket of water. We'll get to that. While we're getting the fireworks, Axel and Olivia will distract the admin. Are you sure I can't just blow up the stage? Uh, that would be distracting. Axel. Then we wait until the big fireworks finale. The what? It's Romeo. I promise you, there will be a huge fireworks finale. Petra and Jack will wait in the order hall. The second those fireworks go off, I go airborne. the bucket of water to create a waterfall. Oh, I was wondering what it was for. And the three of us will head into the tower and use hashtag potato 451 to strip the admin of his powers before he even knows what See? Piece of cake. That might just be the best crazy I've heard in a while. Jesse, this could work. Explosions, excitement, explosions. I love it! This all starts with getting Stella to help us, though. Yeah, she's pretty tight with that admin guy. Is she a friend of yours? She did seem kind of awful. Yeah, I'm not so sure about that one. You're wrong. Stella might have caused a lot of trouble in the past, but I know I got through to her in the Sunshine Institute. We can trust her. 
Pero además, que vemos bien sure hope you're right about that. Eso puede ayudarnos también. Well, Stella does know where the fireworks guild uniforms are. I could follow her to them and then we wouldn't have to talk. Great. Can I say how much I don't like this plan? You can. Because you're staying here. Only Jesse stands a chance on the streets because Jesse is the admin. You don't exactly look like the you we saw earlier. You'll have to change. Jesse, I know you think Stella's on our side, but you can't trust her, okay? Be careful. I think Jesse should be more worried about the admin showing up during this plan. Good luck, friend. One serving of admin coming up. We can do this. Well, okay, ya se no comentó es que haremos una vez que estemos arriba de la torre. Time to find Stella. Mm -hmm. ¿Dónde pasó? Jesse, dude! Just unveiled the new statue you built, oh, yeah. It's got, um, character? Yeah, I kind of liked the old one, but... Whoa! Hey, I mean, you know what? This one is totally rad. I cannot keep my eyes off it. Shah. <laughs> kind of feels like it's, like, following me sometimes, though, you know? Just like that! Bam! Whoa! You know what? I change my mind. Let's bring the old one back, shall we? Dude! Wait to see it again. Not that you know this one wasn't like go with your gut, dude. Especially if it wants the old one back. Yeah. Righteous. Thanks, Jesse, dude. Oh yeah, Jenny. Escondente. What? What? Where? Where is my statue? You there, Nelly? What happened to my statue? Eh, Nell, por favor, dile que no estamos por escondidos. Te agradecería mucho. Tore down because your gut told you to. What? What are you talking about? What is she talking about? Like two seconds ago, you, you, you were... You want to blame your insolence on me? Golems, take her away! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Calm yourself, dude! Like, take some deep breaths, okay? <sighs> oh, no. No. It's a stella. Tengo que apretar chip, es muy difícil apretar chip. No espera, Estela. No es mi tipo. Stella! 
fireworks and banners. It's not my fault. I I'm understaffed. Then hire more people. Force them, conscript them, I don't care. Jesse Kahn will be the greatest thing this town has ever seen, or I will personally ensure you pay the price. Ooh. Ooh. No Where the idea. heck am I supposed to get more people? Bingo, that's our ticket in. Mm -hmm. It's now or never. Perfect, now we can. Oh, gravel, where are those extra Jesse banners? Oh! Stella! Jesse, back so soon. <laughs> <laughs> Since when do you... Hmm, you're not the admin, are you? Hmm? Hmm? Are you hiding the truth? I am not the admin. For I am actually the real bona fide... Jesse! I knew it! Keep your voice down, all right? I am so glad you're back. Pretending to be the other Jesse's loyal servant has been exhausting. Wait, why am I just finding out now you're back? Don't you trust me, Jesse? I thought you'd move past your competitive nature with me. I am part of your core gang. I hate being left out of the loop like this. Surely you have a reason I'm not seeing. I wanted to, but it wasn't safe to contact you with you being so close to the admin. Oh, you were protecting me. We are such best friends. Look, Stella, I need these uniforms to defeat the admin. I don't have time to explain all the... No problemo, friendo. Carry on with your top secret mission. I won't spill anything to the admin. I happen to be an excellent actor. I shall get into character. Let's just, uh, separate, okay? Roger that. Exeunt stage left. Eso es mucho dramatismo. Sinceramente. Ok, sigamos con el plan. Ya conseguimos los uniformes, solo hacen falta los fuegos artificiales, el balde de agua. Y pues subió a un lugar alto para poder llegar a la torre. Sí, que esto es un modo creativo. Jesse, I've got my best friends, Olivia and Axel with me, don't I? Oh. Uh, you? Yes, thanks, Jesse. We love being your best friend. Don't we, Axel? Oh, yeah, totally. The resemblance is uncanny. It's amazing. More like terrifying. What's wrong, Binta? The admin. He's right there. Right in front of me. All the suffering he's caused. Killing Fred, inflicting sorrow on my people. He's so close. I could just charge the stage and take my justice now. Standing here idly, seeing that smile somehow makes it even more unbearable. He's right there, Jesse. Right there. He just looks like you right now. He's not as terrible as you paint him. You're joking, right? I just keep thinking about that tree he planted for Fred. I really think he can be redeemed. And as Jesse, you're Jesse. I'm glad we Let's go to work. Come mm -hmm. to celebrate me. Of course it was mandatory, but I sensed that you wanted to come anyway. So thank you for understanding just how important I am to you. Except... Fireworks, you mean, huh? Jeez, well, get back there then. Thank you. Now we can get to our jobs that we're totally qualified to do. Jack, what do <sighs> I'll find a bucket and report back. Good luck. I hope you can pull this off. There's no fireworks. Just stuff. Come on. Who plans a convention with no fireworks? That's like planning a birthday party without... You know. uh, why can't it ever be easy? <laughs> Please. 
when has it ever been easy? still don't have any fireworks. I guess we'll just need to make some. There has to be enough supplies to craft some paper around here. Then, all we need is gunpowder and a fireworks star. Oh, that would really add some flash. We'll keep a lookout on the exits and stage. Okay, at least it looks like the fireworks union guys already dropped off the fireworks stars. Which one should I take? Love this one. It makes the fireworks shape like a green creeper face. Ah! Ivor! <clears throat> Ivor? Shh! I'm in stealth mode. Completely undetectable to the human eye. How? Invisibility potions. You'll have to take my word for it. They're fantastic. And, um, apparently long lasting. Thanks for the back watching. Of course. It's what I do. High five. Uh... Right, you can't see it. Why do I keep forgetting that? Do you have any more? More what? Invisibility potions. Uh, nope. Sadly, I drank my last one to surprise you here. Ay, but I'm Ay, watching you. From the shadows. Ow. Te sigo viendo, ¿sabes? Por ahí va. Ay, ay, por. Bueno, como sea. Sigamos buscando más piezas para los fuegos traxeles. Sinceramente, ya no, ya no me acuerdo cómo funcionan eso. Eh, cómo crear los que diga. Muy bien, vemos que hay esta caja. Huh, a copy of Lucas's book. Whoever owns this chest must be a fan. Doof. Which proves I'm the greatest thing ever to happen in all your lives. Let's look at the mathematical proof. What a self-absorbed... Ugh. Only for a little while longer. Yeah, we'll get Beacon Town back. I can feel it. Ooh, sugar cane. Stupid. Gunpowder. Perfect. Supongo que es todo. Pero creo que vamos a ocupar también papel. Y creo que eso se hace con la caída de azúcar. Muy bien. Papel. Azúcar. Cuartos especiales. There's a firework. Nice. Now just need to. Hey, Glenn! Hey! I... Wait a minute. You ain't Glenn. Uh, Jack. Petra. And you ain't. Who... Ah, Pinta. Huh? Yeah. Lo salvaste. That felt. That felt good. Really good. Look, you might think the admin is nice, but I know the truth. I did what I had to do. 
We've come too far to second guess ourselves. And we can't let anyone get in our way. Sí, Even bueno. if it's a bystander. Maybe not quite so hard next time. Yes, right. Sorry. <laughs> Creo que dolió, pero no ha, que se not bad. Yeah, I think we've given Binta a bit of a taste for combat. Did you get the bucket? Right here. Good luck up there. I'm going to check on my people. You're welcome back here when this is over. Thank you, Jesse, for everything. Okay, all strapped in, fireworks ready. Oh, no. Uh, Jesse. Uh, hey, Jesse. Yeah. Jesse, we want to talk to you more about how great it is being your friend. Oh, you got it, yes. Bien. Y ahora, ¿cómo lo activo? need to oh perfect just what I needed ha! too slow yeah. dummy come at me ugly uh -oh. Whew, that was close okay time to get the others I was I glad to see that waterfall? Yeah, we were getting kind of nervous down there. Sorry, the welcoming committee was a little strict. Come on, let's get inside. Okay, I'm not the only one that finds all this silence freaky, right? This place is dead. Definitely strange. Though I imagine you might be relieved to have a little quiet right now, huh? Eh. I was almost expecting, I don't know, another huge boss battle or something when we got in here. Yeah, the admin definitely seems to like those. But nothing. Don't be fooled, guys. If it's this quiet on our way to depower the admin, then it's gotta be a trap. Well, I'm not seeing anything trappish yet, but I'll keep an eye out. Mm-hmm. Hay que estar alerta, de hecho. Siempre tiene un truco para ir escondido en el entrenador. ¿Qué es eso? ¡Eh! What's going on? Stand down, Ocelots. Lucas. Lucas. Looks like the tables have finally turned, huh, Jesse? Eh, we can't let you keep doing what you're doing. That's enough now. Whoa, sorry. Guys, Luca. Lucas, I think you're confused. It's me. But we're not confused. 
We know exactly who you are. Lucas. Eh, Now, Lucas. hang on, everyone. Espera un minuto. No. It's our turn to talk, not yours, not anymore. I reformed the Ocelots because I wanted to remind everyone of how things were before. And most of all, I wanted to remind you. No. Because yeah. the Jesse I know wouldn't be running around on some power trip blocking people up. Lucas. Lucas. So yeah, I set your prisoners free. What are you going to do about it? Yeah, and telling us our builds were ugly. Wow, I am so glad you guys are all free. I didn't do any of this. What are you talking about? You were laughing, gloating as you teleported people away. Everything you think I've told you since I came back from the Ice Palace was a lie. The admin locked me in a prison underground, took my identity, came back here, and pretended to be me. That is... No. How do we know this isn't a trick? No trick, friend. And it's not the first time. My friend Voss... The admin did the same thing with him. Yeah, we saw the whole thing. Is this really true? All those horrible things you did that Okay. Yo se lo quiero, yeah. It's you. Well, now that we have that sorted out, what in the world are we going to do next? Wait. Why are you even in here? We're trying to get to something called the terminal. We have a word of passage. <laughs> Potato. That we can apparently use to take away the admin's powers for good. Yeah, a lot of that was way over my head, especially the potato, but I'm in. You just lead the way, and the new ocelots will have your back. Well, would you look at this. Romeo's quite the Jesse memorabilia collector. I know we don't have much time, but it might be smart to suit up properly. Agreed. Let's Maybe ride, Swordbreaker. Now you look like you're ready for a showdown. Agreed. Oh, thanks, guys. Time to end this. Ocelots! Oh! Terminal, what would I look like? Why, hello there. Wasn't expecting you. Ay, Dios. Oh, crud. What's the move here, Jesse? Oh, Maybe you're confused, but this is my office. Heard there might have been people trying to break in, so here I am. Jesse. Hang on, let me try and reason with him. Uh, hello? Jesse? It's over, admin. We're here to... Excuse me, excuse me, we? And in video? What? Where are they? Where'd they go? Oh, I am so upset that you're back. That wannabe ninja Ivor told me you were still in the Sunshine Institute. Hearing that made me feel great. This? This makes me feel... Ugh, bad. Come on, who are you talking to? That dumb prison of yours couldn't hold me. Oh, you smug, arrogant, insignificant. What, oh, yeah. pray tell, are you hoping to accomplish by challenging me? I don't know if you've noticed, but I'm just a touch more powerful than you. I know. That's why I'm not here to fight you. I want to talk this over. Jesse, a uh, Jesse. Ugh, talking it out? What's the point in that? That's what losers do. Real people, awesome people, settle their differences with... with... Combat, dueling, build-offs, not ugh, discourse and debate. I want to talk because I know there's still good in you, Romeo. And I think that if we talk this out, maybe we can come to an understand. You, you really think that? Yeah. I know I was all fiery and mad when you first showed up, but it's just as well. Blimey! I had no idea being you was going to be this difficult! Wait, what? Oh yeah! I'm, I'm, I'm bloody exhausted! 
The, the constant whining, everyone asking for things all the time. Ugh, it's insufferable. I need iron blocks. I better bricks. I don't want to be surrounded by lava. Well, I'm back now. I, I, I could help you take back over. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I suppose you could. Yeah. It's just... <laughs> But it was fun at first. I'd show them some super amazing display of my awesome powers. They'd laugh. I'd laugh. But soon they were just asking me to do that all the time. Vaya. Ah, you, know, you know what's funny? You've made me see something. You know, it, it's starting to feel like maybe I should just leave being Jesse to you. You know? Mm. <laughs> the, the, the genuine article. <laughs> yeah, but maybe that is the best way to proceed. I'm really glad you think so, because I think that's a good idea. Oh, thanks, Jesse. I appreciate that. <sighs> well, this has all been terribly enlightening, and I, I think we've all learned some great lessons here that I will totally remember for next time. Next time? Yeah. Mm. The next world I build after I bedrock over yours. Oh, I'm gonna get it totally right with that Espera, one. Qué no! Oh, Ay, ¿por qué new nunca aprende? set of people. A whole new world. Oh, I'll be a great leader. A great friend next time around. I should thank you for all these... These wonderful little lessons you've helped me to learn. Oh, maybe... Maybe I'll have more fjords in the next one. Oh, I love a good fjord. Yes, I wonder if there's any way to make the next set of people any friendlier. Huh. Now hang on a second, Romeo. We can still be friends. You don't have to bedrock over anything. Yeah? You, you really think so? Yes! Mm. Nah. Bedrocking Ay, time. Diablos. Oh well. Toodles! <laughs> Oh, this doesn't seem good. Oh, you guys are okay. Yeah, he just blipped us back to the hallways again. Such a, whew, such a jerk. Stop this. We need to take his powers away. Find the terminal space. The roof. That's where the admin keeps his portal to the terminal thing. Go. Come on. We need to get to that portal before the bedrock closes up. Here. Yeah, but we don't know where here is. Un mundo de locos al parecer. Found the Colossus. Uh, the trip down memory lane is nice and all, but how do we find the primary terminal thingy? 
There is so much stuff in here. Yeah, kind of hard to make sense of it all. The old-fashioned way, looking around, with our eyes. We have to find something that can help guide us. What about... Support protocol initiated! It's him! Oh, uh, it's mm, just oh, more of his stupid recordings. You've selected support protocol. Oh, it's like a automatic assistant or something. Welcome to Terminal Space. Bye. Oh, yeah. Well, shall we? So, wait. He has this whole assistant thing set up, but only he ever comes here? The automated personal assistant system was developed to aid the mighty admin in menial tasks and help his friends navigate the terminal space. Okay. Man, so when he first made all this, he was still hoping his friends would come here, too. Kinda... makes me feel bad for him, actually. Is that...? Enter your password to begin a new program. I. That was all over my head. Password, password, password. That must be the word of passage. Hashtag potato 451. It's empty? Waiting for material request. I mean, it must be talking about the potato, right? Sounds right to me. Uh, potato? Please? Acquiring... Potatoes! Items dispensed. Thank you! Wait, two potatoes? Yeah, a normal one and a poisoned one. Which one do we use? I mean, the word of passage didn't say anything about poison, but it did have that weird hashtag thingy. That might mean something? Oh, I don't think that symbol ever actually means anything. Hmm. Gotta figure out which one is correct. I hope this is right. I still need to enter the rest of the word of passage. I don't know if this is right or not till I do. Okay, okay, that sounds like progress, right? Parrot party protocol initiated. Uh, I'm, uh, I'm guessing that's not quite right. Agreed. Sorry, parrots. Entonces, ¿era venenada? Was that a good thud or a bad thud? It's Fred? Sara, hi. If 
if you're seeing this recording, well, I guess the worst has happened. And you just put the word of passage into the primary terminal. I wish the terminal could just take away Romeo's admin powers. It'd be easier that way. But making this gauntlet was the best I could do. Put your hand into the pedestal to receive the gauntlet. It's got the power to make Romeo normal again. It might take a few hits to remove his powers entirely, but it'll get the job done. Do you understand? Then good luck, Sara. You're... I think you might need it. Well, here goes nothing. What do you think you're doing? What's happening? We're here to stop you, Romeo, once and for all. I told you, your world's done. No take that. No man. Chassis, hurry. <laughs> this with a little change of scenery. The... the sea temple? Kalu Kale, Jesse. Remember when we first met? Oh, that was back when I thought we could still be friends. Huh. Figures. This temple, this challenge, is my first Give to you. Now, it's going to be where I bury you. Ah. Running out of platforms. Nowhere to run. Still use the gauntlet. Just die already. This is impossible. No one gets to make me small. I can't. Why do I feel so powerless? Come on! I certainly hope you're enjoying this trip Whoa. down memory lane as much as I am. Ah. 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 
Fue golpe. Jaja, <risa> ya no puede. Oh, I am very much starting to hate that stupid gauntlet. Games are over, admin. Give it up. Oh, I am going to. Special Romeo. Powers don't make anyone special. It's who you are, how you act. Don't you judge me! You don't get to judge me! Give me back! Uh, that that, that's the cause of all this! Uh, let's go! Uh, True, admin. It's over. You can say that again. How's that level playing field feel, huh, jerk? Get away from me! Oh, 
Why do you have to go and make everything so difficult? Everyone likes you. And you're nothing. Hey, we're not the ones trying to rule the world. What? Uh -huh. No, no, I'm not. I just... I just wanted people to... Hola, ¿qué está pasando? This place is held together by my powers. No more powers. No more terminal zone. <laughs> We're doomed. We're gonna get buried if we don't get out of here pronto. What about him? What about him? He's not our problem anymore. But look at him. He'll never make it out of here on his own. Oh, she's right. Just... just leave me. My power... It was just frosting on a, on a cake. An empty, worthless cake. No, this is where I belong. This is where I'll pay for what I've done. I can't believe that, that this is what it took for me to realize. Oh, I've been... Just so stupid, so blind. You can still fix things, Romeo. No matter what you've done, you're still a person. Like everyone else, you can be redeemed. Redeemed? You... You really believe that, don't you? Jesse, now's the time. We gotta go. Go on, leave me. I deserve to stay in this oblivion. Come on, this place is falling apart. We can decide what happens to him later. Let's grab him and go. Now! You're not staying here. That would be the coward's way out. Come on. If we get to that portal before we do, we'll be stuck here forever. Let's move! Not a minute too soon. Oh my gosh! It's not to following me, right? Right? No, it's not. Nah, I think you're in the clear, Slim. Hey, nice work. I I thank you sincerely I hardly believe that I deserve to be here at all anymore 
I do know what I need to do to make up for my crimes, though. I'm gonna return to the underneath. Try to help all the people I left behind. Fix all the lives I... ruined. And I'm gonna try and find Zara. See if I can't make things right between us. I mean, it doesn't make up for what I... Or what I did to Fred. But if I can heal things with Zara... Well, it's something, at least. And... and no more admin powers. Everything I do now will just be the normal way. Hope I can still remember how the normal way even works. That sounds fine, Romeo, but it's only the start. You have a lot of making up to do. I know. It's true. Save the world again, huh? Doesn't that ever get old? Why, yes, thank you for noticing. Thought we'd fit in a light bit of world saving before afternoon pie time. Happy to see you all in one piece, too. Whoa, 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 whoa! Is that the admin? Is he- Don't worry. He's not the admin anymore. This is Romeo. Well, that's a relief. No more admins for me, thank you very much. <laughs> I agree with that 112%, Blondie. But Jesse, after everything he did, do you- you really think he deserves to go free? What if he hurts more people? He might... He might have been better off where he was. I know he was terrible, but I saw him sitting there, and I just couldn't do it. Even if he did deserve it, I just couldn't live with myself if I trapped him there. Well, that's because you're a good person, Jesse. But... I just hope it was the right decision. What do you guys say we head home? I say... Way ahead of you, friend. <laughs> Me too. Man, I cannot wait to put on a shirt again. Jesse! I work. I am approaching you from this direction and am coming to speak with you. No ninja trickery, hijinks, or tomfoolery here. <laughs> After all the times you've snuck up on me recently, I appreciate that. Precisely my intention! My days of sneaking up on people are behind me. Gracias. So, no more ninja Ivor then? Ha! Huh. No, no. I decided it was time to stop running around in my pajamas and start trying to fix a few messes. Starting with trying to heal the rift between my old friends. Magnus is easy. We'll just pop by Boomtown. Last I heard, Gabriel was doing the wandering warrior thing. <laughs> Soren? No idea where he is, but I've got some leads. Yeah, take it from me. It might be awkward, but I swear it'll be worth it. Good to know. It won't be the first time I've created an awkward situation. <laughs> <laughs> well, I suppose it's time for me to go. This has been fun, though, hasn't it? Jesse! Jesse, hey! What's up, Radar? I was just saying goodbye to... Mm. Guess ninja habits die hard. Sí, nunca cambian. I, uh... I hope you don't mind, but uh, I've kind of been taking charge of the beautification project. I thought, why not at least make it look intentional? Really stepping it up to leader mode, if I do say so myself. And it's been stressful, but also fun. So like fun, stressful, stress fun? Anyway, I think I've been doing a pretty good job. You've definitely been stepping it up. I'm really proud of you. Oh, wow, this is best day. Whoa! Hey, Luna! Hey, Luna! 
Anyway, uh, so with Champion City gone, I was going to make Luna a new llama house and get her set up here in Beacon Town while I help out up there. But uh, before I did, I thought I'd uh, double check and see if you'd already you'd been planning on, you know, uh, watching out for her. Seeing, you know, that she likes you so much and all. If you've already built her a llama house when I haven't been around, I, I, I just wouldn't want to double up. Which, by the way, I'd be okay with you doing if you'd already built one, or were planning to. I just want to be sure. And if she wants to stick with me, it'll be my honor to keep taking care of her. I think she'll really like that. I always considered you a part of the family. Okay. Well, <laughs> stupid emotions. I do want to sincerely thank you, Jesse, for everything. You saw me at my worst, and you still thought I was worth saving. That, well, that makes me want to try to be better at being my best. Hoping I can start by helping clean up this dump. The, <clears throat> you know, poor town. Yeah, what can I say? I looked below the surface and saw that you probably weren't the worst all the way down. What was that about Stella being the worst? <laughs> huh? Hey! I was just telling Stella here that I would take care of Luna for her. Oh, cool. Well, she seems very excited. Yes, and now I must go. Thank you again for everything. Sincerely. Now, you got everything you need, all packed and double-checked? Yes, Jack. This is very, I don't know, bittersweet for me, you know. Goodbyes are no good. <laughs> that we have, Nermi. So, I won't say it this time. <laughs> Not to people that I will see again. <laughs> you got it. Come on, walk me to the gate. So, you're leaving, apparently? For how long? Honestly, probably a while. But it's good this time. I'm doing it for me. I'm trying to, like, grow or whatever. Anyway, I'm about to say goodbye to everyone, and I... Ah! I'm here. <laughs> I promised myself I wouldn't cry. Promise oh, broken. Jeez, it'll be okay. So Petra's heading off into the Great Unknown, huh? <laughs> I figured. Definitely sounds exciting. Could start a new town, find temples or dungeons or... whatever you hack and slash types do. I bet Petra would extend the invite. You could go, too. I appreciate that, but... I think it's time I settled down here. I just got the ocelots back together. Thought maybe I'd work on a new book. Hey! You guys are missing out on prime group hug action. Ah! No air! Actually dying! I got some with the Petra. You don't think this is like the last time we'll all be together, do you? No. Well, maybe. I don't know. I mean, if Petra's leaving. No, hang on. Let's not put all the pressure on me here. Nah, I got a feeling we'll all be together again. I don't know when, don't know where, but it'll happen. I hope so. <laughs> that sounds nice. <laughs> okay, well, I'm gonna get out of here before I... <laughs> too late. Bye, guys. Be safe out there, okay? The safest. And when you finish that book of yours, I better have a great part in it. Uh-huh. <laughs> Back in the admin's cabin, I, I know you promised that we'd always stick together. But the invite's still open if you want it. No pressure. Wait, you're leaving?
Yeah, I think Petra and I are going to hit the road for a while. <gasps> Sounds pretty awesome, right? Yeah, yeah, I mean, I mean it does, but, but without you here, who will run Beacon Town? Things are peaceful now, but danger could still strike at any time. Uh, the people could, uh, they could revolt or something. Who do you think, pal? You! Me? Really? Yeah. I hereby promote you from intern to hero in residence. Thanks, boss. This, uh, you have been, you are. No, yeah. What I'm trying to say is that I promise I'll make you proud. You already have. Everyone's going to miss you, you know? And I'm gonna miss them too. But if anyone ever really needs me, I'll be around. No voy a extrañar, de hecho. Los amigos son primero. Adiós, chicos. Bye, everyone. Hey, Tummy, you gonna wait up or what? I was kind of hoping you'd be interested in a race. Ah, you're on! Hacia el desconocido, chicos! Supongo que eso es todo, chicos. Muchas gracias por acompañarme en estos viajes increíbles de Mac Story Mod y también les agradezco mucho a los que me comentaron sobre las decisiones que podría tomar en futuros episodios de Mac Story Mod, todos en Wattpad, muchas gracias, profundamente muchas gracias, los agradezco mucho, ya que aparece me hicieron crear una increíble historia para este gameplay. Eso sería todo por hoy y pues bueno, de igual manera pueden comentar en los comentarios qué otro juego puedo jugar en un futuro. Y pues ya veré si puedo hacerlo y si te, te podré tener el tiempo también, eso es importante. De todas maneras, te los agradezco mucho y pues nos vemos hasta la próxima. Bye bye.